Hello friends, welcome to lecture number 21 that is integration of the Selenium tests with the Team City server. In this lecture you will learn how to set up the Selenium project, how to set up the build configuration on the Team City and how to run the tests. So I have already installed the Team City server on my machine and as you can see this is how the Team City server looks like over there. If you go to the main page or the dashboard here you will see all the projects and you can also view all the configurations in those projects by expanding them like that in this particular project we have got three build configurations so to create the build configuration you have to go to administration and then there you can create a project uh, from the pointing to repository url pointing to github or you can also create manually so if you know the github url you can click on this or you can also click on this pointing to github.com repository and then you can give the url of the project so as you can see we have already push our project into this particular URL of the github so you can create the project from that URL you can notice that I have already created the selenium as this project I'm just gonna show you some important uh, build steps that you need to add to configure this particular build selenium build so there this is the project settings and here this is one our build configuration so just click on edit button and uh, over there you will it will display all the build configuration settings here you can give the name of the build and then you, you can give the build counter then in the version control settings you can uh, give the url of the github repository and then in the build steps uh, you have to actually give the actual uh, tasks that you want to perform so to execute the our tests in this uh, team city what you have to do is first of all use this particular line of code notice that we have used this powershell runner type but if if you want you can also use microsoft visual studio ms build or visual studio solution to build the project and to execute the tests you can use visual studio tests but i have uh, done all that in the powershell script as you can see over there this is the powershell script code and there are three things i am doing over here first of all downloading all the nugget packages using this particular command nugget.exe restore selenium project.xln what it will do is it will download all the packages that are required for this particular project or the solution file then after getting these references uh, what I'm doing is building the project using MS build tool and after the bu uh, building the project it will create the bin slash debug slash or project DLL in that particular directory and once we get the DLL what we have to do is use this ms test command to execute the tests so test container this parameter is required wherein we specify from which DLL we want to execute our test so this is the DLL so all that is done and then clicked on save and after that you can execute your tests by clicking on this run button so what happens is after you click on the run button it starts executing the tests as you can see there is one agent over there it has started running it what it, it will do is it will download all the required packages and then build the project using ms build and then start executing the tests so it is compiling the files in that project and then finally it will start executing the tests using ms test tool so you can see that build is successful and it is trying to execute the test from this dll file As you can see the driver has started and Chrome browser will also be launched after this. As you can see the Chrome browser is also launched and it started executing these tests. So I'm just going to stop this. To stop this build uh, what you can do is click on this small arrow and then click on stop so from this dashboard you can see like which tests are running or the builds are running and you can also stop from it uh, this builds any builds from here as well or you can also run the customized build as well from this particular menu so that is how you can set up your selenium project or run your selenium tests that were created in visual studio on team city that ends our lecture number 21 that is integration with the team city thanks for watching this video